I'm opening my own hotel in GTA 5. And I'll do whatever it takes to upgrade it again and again and again until we have the best hotel in town. But right now, we're gonna need to do a lot of upgrades because this is falling apart. Hey, where's that guy riding to? He must really need the toilet. Wait, is everything okay? It's crazy. It's crazy in there. Oh, boy. Oh, all right, so uh, that's not exactly the best review. Um, I haven't actually been inside this place. I just bought it this morning for 10 bucks. The guy was quite keen to sell it to me, too. Uh, are these the toilets? Hey, aren't they meant to be using the toilets in the room? This is a bit weird. Okay, and there's a snack room at the other side of the toilets. <laughs> this is so weird. What kind of hotel is this? And I can already see some work I gotta do. Check it out. It's telling me to cook lunch. Don't I have, like, a chef to cook lunch for me or something? Is there anything else? Wait, there's something else over there we gotta do. What does that say? Oh, my days. It's red. I don't like the look of that, dude. <laughs> oh, my days. Wait, have I really gotta do that? Kick a guest out. I thought we meant to have security for that. All right, guys. Clearly, this uh, place isn't exactly as attractive as I thought it was gonna be. I mean, the walls are falling apart, and it could definitely... Oh, my days. That's a pig. What are you doing in my hotel? <laughs> Get out of here. Go, go. No wonder why I gotta clean the room. Jeez. Oh, my goodness. Wait, there's someone in the room. Hey, man, can you get out, please? Right, that's it. I'm gonna have to send him out. I gotta clean the room. Hey, bro, I'm not gonna ask you again. Get out of my room now. <laughs> Leave! Hey, I just got 12 bucks. Nice. Right, that's it. I am making the executive decision. You are losing your deposit, my friend. <laughs> if we even charge them on the rooms, of course. All right, let's get this guy out of here so I can finally clean this room up. Okay. <laughs> this is crazy. Where did my door go? I'm pretty sure there was a door there. And I don't know what that was, but that's broken too. Man, he even trashed the blind. Oh! I don't want to hear another word from you. All right, let's get this place cleaned up. This is going to take a while. Jeez, man. How does one person make this much mess? What do the other rooms look like? Oh, here we go. Room number nine. All right, let's go in. This is really nice. No way. To think the rooms could actually look like this. Do we really do this kind of service? And I just realized that's the same bed from Michael's house. We actually have a little bit of luxury in here. And have you seen the size of that TV? Clearly, this isn't as bad as I thought it was. Wait, yeah, what are you doing under the table? Get out of my room. Oh, yeah, sure. He doesn't want me in the room. Okay, fair enough. You enjoy your burger and fries, I guess. Um, yeah. Have fun with that. Wait, I just realized I gotta cook lunch, haven't I? And I gotta kick a guest out who is apparently down here. Okay, let's get the job done, I guess. I've already kicked one person out, so this won't be too tricky. Hey, excuse me. We're gonna have to... Oh, my days. What happened to you? He's not even talking to me. Oh, my goodness. Okay, right. Here's the deal. I'm just gonna pick you up and we're gonna get you out of here, okay? <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, no wonder why he didn't leave. He wasn't even waking up. Anyway, let's look at this one because this is also a nice room. There's an office and there's a printer. Oh, wait, was that a rat? Oh, my goodness. Guys, I've just seen a rat. Gotta be kidding me. Oh, my days. There's rats here. Get out Get out of here, rats. This is my hotel. Where's the other guy? Get out of here. <laughs> All right, we got a bit of a rap problem, but apart from that, everything's fine. In fact, if you want to stay here, you can. I'll even give you a discount if you like the video now. Anyway, moving on, let's look at what other luxury is waiting for us inside this room, because I'm pretty sure there's plenty of luxury. Yeah, air conditioning, giant TV. I haven't even seen the bathrooms yet. Let's take a look. Ooh. Look at this. There's a bath. And there's even soap. And a sink. Toilets. You don't have to use the outside loos when you're in this place. I'm gonna call this one the Master Suite. No, the King Suite. Only kings are allowed to stay there. I'll even add some security on if we get a little bit more money. Another rat? Are you serious? Get out of here. Come on. We can't allow rats in my hotel. In fact, that's giving me an idea. I gotta cook lunch. I mean... <laughs> Who doesn't like uh, something new? Something exotic? Oh, and if you're not interested in the new kind of food, we got some of these too. <laughs> Gonna make delicious burgers. Excuse me. Uh, yes. Uh, oh, hello. Uh, how can I help you? I would like to book a room. Book a room? Well, as it happens, we have our king suite just over to the right. How would you like to book that? My friends, you have a deal. Great. Oh, and uh, only two people can sleep in there. They're not coming with you, right? No, 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 no. Don't worry about them. <sighs> All right, I don't want to party or anything. Okay, well, the room's over there. It's where the red marker is. Uh, ignore the person lying down outside. Oh, if you want some lunch, it'll be ready in 10 minutes, by the way. Uh, I'm okay, thanks. Enjoy your day. Uh, wait, you two, they're not going... 
Did they all just follow? Okay, I'm gonna take his word that they're not staying with him. We can't have that many guests. Yes, we can finally upgrade this place. Looks like we made enough money after all. So I guess to upgrade, we gotta go into that thing. I mean, this literally just appeared in the middle of nowhere. Uh, is this? Yep, $500. Is that how much? We made 500 bucks. Nice, okay. <laughs> Let's get this thing upgraded. Now this looks way better. For 500 bucks? We're on the beach. I can rent jet skis to people. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to get some people on those. There's a barbecue I can cook. And I love the way this hotel is. Every single door is a different color. Man, this is the happiest hotel ever. In fact, I want to go inside and see what one of the rooms look like. Let's go into the green room. Whoa. There's a bottle of soda, a backpack, even a bodyboard. Nice. A fridge. Don't think we had one of those in the last room. This is exactly what you want if you go into the beach. Even a donut, some sun cream, a volleyball, a parasol, and some sun lounges too. Never thought I'd be running a beach hotel. To be honest, I never thought I'd be doing this, but this guy asked me to do this video, so I couldn't resist. And if you want to see anything else, let me know in the comments what ideas you want to see. Hey, what do you know? We already got some customers. Oh, so you want to rent a jet ski? Well, first of all, I need to make sure you're a resident at the hotel. Have you got a room? No. Well, since you don't stay at the hotel, I can't rent you a jet ski. I'm sorry, the rules are the rules. A book of room. Ah, that's more like it. Well, it's actually $200 a night. You got that knocking around? Yeah, sure. And the jet skis, they're $100 an hour. What do you say? Deal. <laughs> nice, that was the easiest sale ever. All right, enjoy your jet ski. Be very careful and don't go over any of the swimmers, okay? Stay as far out as you can. I know how to ride a jet ski. Ugh. How do you switch this on? He doesn't even know how to switch the jet ski on. <laughs> All right, my friend, just flick up the red box it's next to your hand and press the button. I knew that. All right, I'm going to get on the barbecue and begin cooking. Make sure there's some food ready. You guys have fun on the jet skis. We're going to make so much money than the last place, especially when they start smelling what I'm going to cook on the barbecue. This is the life. Cooking burgers for people on the beach. Uh, that doesn't look good. It's just getting into the swing of things soon. Wait, is that a shark? Oh, boy. Okay, we got sharks coming over to this beach as well. Have to get that thing cleaned up. What is going on over there? I better get a closer look at this. Help! Somebody! Help me! Oh, no. That's the person who rented a jet ski from us. All right, well, help is on the way. Gotta be careful about the sharks. I don't want to get eaten whilst I'm on the job. Since it's a private hotel, I gotta be the lifeguard as well. Because we don't exactly have the money to have one. How in the world do you set your jet ski on fire? You're surrounded by water, my friend. <laughs> it's literally impossible. I can't even see him. There's so much smoke. He's in the middle of all of it. Are right, we going in? Uh, excuse me. If you're on the jet ski, you're going to need to get off right now. Well, at least we got you on the back. Okay, listen. We're going to have to call the fire brigade on that thing. I don't know what you did, but that's not normal. And by the way, you're paying $10,000, okay? That was a really good jet ski, and I'm not paying the bill for it. Fine. I'm sorry. Can I rent another? No, you definitely can't ran another. Now go and enjoy a burger or something, or even play some volleyball. We got everything you could possibly want to do on the beach. Unless you try and set a surfboard on fire. I mean, I wouldn't put it past you. Whatever. I'm leaving. Good riddance. I don't want any more trouble around here. In fact, we don't have to be around here much longer because we can upgrade our hotel again. <laughs> we don't gotta try and get a new jet ski with that. I'm just gonna spend the money on a brand new hotel upgrade. Oh man, this hotel looks so nice. We're still on the beach, which I'm really happy with. There's even one of these stands outside. You can get ice cream here. Beautiful. And there's a coffee stand. We even have a private beach area. I don't recognize this. This has to belong to the hotel. All right, if anyone wants to relax on the beach in their own private space, order some room service or something, this is the place to go. <laughs> wow. I just love the look of this hotel. There's even a clock on the top. It looks like there's a rooftop as well. All right, I gotta go and check this out. I can see plenty of rooms, plenty of places. I wanna go inside and see what we're talking. Whoa, hey, wait. There's a Chef? Hey, have I got my own staff? Howdy, boss. Yeah, howdy to you as well. I even have my own receptionist. No way. Hey, uh, if anyone comes in, it's 500 bucks a night. All right, this is prime location. There's even a cleaner. I don't remember getting a cleaner. Hey, thanks. You're doing a great job. What do the rooms look like, actually? I hope there's 
no one in here. I'm sorry if there is. No, this one's empty. All right, brilliant. So this is what one of the rooms looks like. Is there a balcony? That would be amazing. All right, no balcony. That's fine. We got a really nice chair to relax, a lovely view of the beach, a giant TV, a sofa, and a double or even a king-size bed. That's a very big bed. <laughs> and this is the bathroom. It's open plan, exactly what you want. Yeah, these rooms are pretty spacious. This is floor number two, and up here is floor number three. There's so many rooms. <laughs> this has to be one of the biggest hotels yet. Oh, what's this? Throw party. Wait, I can throw a party at this hotel? This is better than any sort of barbecue. So there's a pool on top of here, which I didn't even realize existed. It's not that deep, but if you decide to collapse, you can swim around in this thing. This is the best hotel ever. You're way better than the ones up there, Von Krastenberg or whatever you're called. There's even a jacuzzi. Right, I'm gonna have to rent that space out for, I don't know, 50 bucks an hour or something. Yeah, I'm really happy. This is a really nice hotel. And you know I gotta throw a party. We are gonna have the best party in Los Santos at my brand new hotel. Whoa, that was quick. Okay, so the party has officially begun. It's currently the evening, the sun is low in the sky, and we've got so many people here, and they look like they're having a great time. I mean, look at them, they're dancing on the edge of the swimming pool. Oh, we gotta get that hot tub open soon enough. Oh, there's someone hanging out over here. Hey, man, I don't think you should be over here. This is where the guests are trying to sleep. They ain't gonna go sleep tonight. Oh, you're probably right about that, actually. Hey, man, stop talking to the cleaner. All right, let's just go downstairs. I'll leave him do it. She's trying to do her job. I'm trying to do mine. And just as I thought, there's even more things happening down here. Just make sure you don't trash the place, okay? This is a beautiful hotel. I want to make sure it gets looked after. Hey, guys, you're doing a great job, by the way. We even got a DJ. Are you guys trying to check in? There's two rooms upstairs if you want them. Wait, there's someone out here. Hey, man, why do you come inside? Valet my car to the car park. Oh, my days. Is that your car? Yes. Now take it somewhere safe. Yeah, you got it, man. Wow, I'm valeting this guy's car. It's a classic. I'm pretty sure it's gold. Alright, you go inside. We'll sort you out with a room or a suite or whatever it is you need. I didn't even see these two. There's even nicer cars outside. Alright, I actually don't know where I'm parking this because I'm pretty sure there isn't a garage. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is the only place you're gonna leave cars. Right, you know what? I'm gonna leave it in there and uh, I just won't tell anyone, okay? That's gonna be the best thing to do. Wait, I can't even get through. They fenced this off. Hmm. All right, just don't tell them, guys. Wait, oh, jeez. <laughs> Okay, I'm gonna do something which I'm pretty sure I'm not allowed to do, but it's worth a shot. Let's just throw one of these down, blow the fence up, and we'll drive straight through. Yeah, with the party happening next door, I don't think anyone heard a thing. Now, I'm gonna put this car right next to the hotel so I can keep an eye on it at all times. It looks like a really expensive one. I would hate for anything to happen to this. Anyway, I want to join in with the party. I don't want to miss out on all the fun. Why is the chef calling me? Uh, yeah, what do you want? Can you do room service? This party is taking up all of our time. Room service? Yeah, okay. That does sound quite fun. Floor three, room one. All right, I got it. Floor three, room one. Burger and chips. All right, we can do that. Is this a chicken burger? It's a chicken burger. Nice. <laughs> Looks pretty tasty as well. All right, floor number three. This is floor number one. Hey, that smells good. Yeah, it does. Get your nose away from it. All right, this is my food. Hey, give me a bite. No, it's not for you, my friend. It's for uh, floor number three, room number one. All right, this has got to be it. Oh, my days. Uh, Did you order room service? If that's a chicken burger in your hand, then yes. We did order room service. All right, great. So, uh, so where do you want this chicken burger then? Put it down on the sides in the bathroom. Okay, nice. Uh, uh, please send help. Uh, sorry, I don't want to get involved in this. Thanks. Now turn around and leave. Yep, you got it, my friend. You got it. I am so out of there. What was going on in that room? Hey, Luke, he doesn't know where the money is. What do we do? Yeah, take him out. I don't know. I'm enjoying my bug. I'm getting out of there. No way am I staying on this floor much longer. I don't remember renting that room out to those guys. Floor two, room one, two burgers in a bun. Nice. This is gonna fill you up pretty good. <laughs> All right, floor two, room one. Here we go, floor two. Excuse me, out the way. Lo oh, my days. Hey, 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 man, you got uh, room service? Yes, uh, I did. Uh, uh. Ugh, is it lean? Uh, what, what do you mean, lean? What, what? The burger, is it lean? Uh, um, uh, yeah, I, I guess. I am protein and lots of other things. Put it on the side. No, the floor. No, leave it outside. Uh, you, you sure? Right outside? The cleaner's gonna clean it up. I'll do it. Okay, all right, fine. I'll, 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 
This guy's crazy. All right, leave it outside. But we have officially made enough money to upgrade to the next hotel. How much have we made already? <laughs> this has been quite the night. There it is. $100,000. No way. $100,000? We made that in one night? Well, I gotta say, Franklin, I'm impressed. But I want to see what the next upgrade is. I have my own tower in the city. Tell your friends about this place because this is the best hotel in town. In fact, I don't need you guys to tell your friends. We've already got people here. This is a popular place to hang out. And if you want to come along, you can, I guess. If we got a free room, I mean, look at the amount of rooms in this hotel. There's so many. And there's air conditioning in every single one of them. What are you doing up there? That's dangerous. Hey, I, I gotta get him down. Whoa! What? Just... Okay, guys, uh, there's been a bit of an explosion. Um, <laughs> okay, right, here's the deal. I'm gonna call the uh, fire brigade. Go inside and see if I can point it out. This is crazy. How did the building just explode? Not what I want to be dealing with when I've just opened up my brand new hotel. I spent $100,000 on this place. Now I gotta put a fire out. Oh, my days. This building's gonna collapse if I don't do anything. It's coming from in that room. Oh, man, there's a lot of fire, dude. Okay, three, two, one, go! Oh, jeez, there's so much fire. All right, we're putting it out. Put it out, Franklin. Put it out. Use the fire extinguisher. Put it out, dude. Whoa. <laughs> this is crazy. How did this even happen in the first place? Hey, excuse me. You can't be doing yoga on the roof. It's dangerous up here. Did he not hear me? Come on, there was just an explosion. Oh, wait, wait. Are those police officers? Oh, my goodness. There's police officers. Uh, what's going on? Get on your knees. Now. You guys are the ones who try to blow this place up. Well, guess what? <laughs> Have this. Yeah, fire extinguisher in the face. Uh, take him away, boys. I don't want to see these two faces again. I put so much money into this hotel. And it stinks. Yeah, well, it stinks in jail as well. Have a good time in there. <laughs> anyway, I got actual business to do because I got to run this place. Or we could upgrade this place again. Right now, it feels like I've only been here for two minutes, but you guys can upgrade it if you press the subscribe button. I kind of want to get it upgraded. I mean, I don't know what kind of things we're going to put up with here. Considering that guy tried to blow this building up. I will win. We'll see about that because I need you to press the subscribe button and clearly you haven't done it already because it's still asking you to do it. Come on, please. It wouldn't actually be that bad to upgrade this place straight away. Can you imagine what the next place is gonna look like when this looks like this? I don't even know how much it costs to upgrade this place, but if this costs $100,000, we're probably looking at like a million or something. You just gave me a million bucks. Thanks. <laughs> we can upgrade. You guys are the best. You're not gonna regret this. What do we get? for one million dollars. The best hotel in downtown. No way, we've done it. This place looks amazing. There's even a projector on the side of the building and our very own subway station. <laughs> This is amazing. There's an actual stop for this place. So let's go check out our hotel for $1 million. This has to be the craziest hotel I've seen. You know what? This is a bargain for a million bucks. All of this, this would at least be like a billion. So if you want to stay here, uh, head off at Pillbox South. Just follow the area. I mean, we'll find the entrance. It's got to be around here somewhere. And to think I'm running this. Whoa. Whoa. This is mine. Are you out of your mind? Welcome to Franklin's brand new luxury. Luxury hotel. There's a drink spa down here. That is amazing. We gotta get some people in. We gotta charge like a thousand bucks a night. No, two thousand. No, three thousand dollars a night. I'm sure we could squeeze some people for that. There's a waterfall inside here and a golden camel because why not? <laughs> so this is where you can check in. Nice. We got a reception area. Hey, where are the receptionists? That's more like it. All right, I want you guys at the desk at all times. And I don't want any excuses. In fact, there's clocks behind you, so there really are no excuses. All times. Oh, no way. There's a car park underneath my hotel. Level minus three. Wait, how big's this car park? All right, I'm just gonna borrow one of these supercars. I'm sure they don't mind. I'm the hotel owner. I got the keys to everything. And let's just take it for a little spin around this uh, car park, shall we? Check it out. Oh my goodness. It just keeps going. We're now at minus one. And this must be the uh, entrance, I guess. All the way to the street side. Nice. I still haven't seen the actual, like, proper hotel. Okay, here's the deal. I'm parking this one right at the top. And we gotta tell him that, uh, I, I don't know. We had to move his car or something. Close the door. I don't want anyone taking this. Not on my watch. Anyway, let's go upstairs because I want to see how big this place really is. The lobby, the French restaurant, the lounge, the swimming pool, the atmosphere, the office, the spa and gym, or the rooms. I'm checking out the French restaurant. I, I gotta see that place first. Un dilemme du ventre. French cuisine. I have no idea what that is, but it's 
expensive. We're selling expensive stuff in here, ladies and gentlemen. And can you blame me? The hotel is just expensive. In fact, this is the kitchen and oh, the best kitchen I've ever seen. We've worked in a restaurant and none of my kitchens were as big as this. It even comes with a pantry. An actual pantry. So this is the lounge overlooking the lobby. This is the indoor lounge. I love the red rugs and the brown chairs. Oh, very nice. Now back to the lift. I want to check out the next floor. Let's go check out the swimming pool. All right, yeah, wherever this place, oh my days, it's outside. Okay, so this is where you can pick up your towels. And this is where you can go swimming. Nice. I'm jumping in myself. You can get a suntan. You can enjoy the swimming pool. This is a good life. What in the world is down here? Ooh, private lounge is nice. Okay, you gotta pay a lot of money to go here. I've decided if you want the window lounge, premium rate. The most expensive. There's already some guests enjoying themselves. Nice. Right, you guys have fun. I'm going upstairs again. Oh my days. Yeah, I could get used to this kind of life. <laughs> <laughs> all right, Franklin, this is where we're going to be doing all of our work with gold bars next to us. Room service menu. This is the most over-the-top office I've ever seen. I mean, wh why is my computer, like, covered in plastic? And there's ladders to get to the top shelf. Okay, that was pretty awesome, but I still haven't seen everything. We're going to go to the spa and the gym. To think we came from the motel to this? How is that even possible? Oh, Wow, infrared sauna. Whoa, all right, that's pretty freaky. So this is where you could be staying in one of these beautiful rooms. Whoa. <laughs> all right, I'm gonna go and check out this one first. Hello, is there anyone? All right, it's empty. Nice, okay, no one's sleeping in here. So we got a little tour of the hotel on the TV. Nice, I like that. Let's go through here to our bathroom. Pretty good bathroom with a bath and a view over Los Santos. I take it this is the closet. Yep, walk-in wardrobe. Nice, all the space you could dream of. And that is one of the rooms. Are they all the same? Let's go into 107. No, that's locked. There's someone in there. All right, what about 106? It looks pretty much the same. Okay, I'm gonna go and check out the sixth floor because if anything's gonna be different, it's gonna be at the top. And last but not least, the rooftop. Only frankly allowed up here. This is the best hotel in the world, and I can't believe we actually own this place now. Which hotel was your favorite? Let me know below. Smash like if you enjoyed, and don't forget to subscribe. But thanks for watching. My name is Nord, and until next time, stay awesome.